How's it going people of YouTube? My name is Adam and welcome to a Duda Reviews, an entertainment channel for entertainment purposes. If you're new here, then please consider liking and subscribing. It's a warm and friendly place. There's just me, but I will make you feel really welcome with a cup of tea. Would you like a cup of tea, mate? Thanks, Mickey. Love one. Milk and sugar? Please. How many sugars? Two. Right. Two or a coffee, or maybe a beer, or perhaps a whiskey. Bourbon on the rocks. That'll do it. Whatever your poison is. Um, today, I'm gonna to be talking about the new Marvel film, the, the one I've been waiting for, Shang-Chi. Who are you? Shang-Chi stars Simu Lee as the title character, Aquafina as his crazy sidekick, Katie, and the villain of the piece, the Mandarin, is played by Tony Leung. I'm not gonna go into massive detail about the plot other than the fact that Shang-Chi and his friend Katie are on a bus ride home. They're attacked by these crazy villain guys for whatever reason, and Shang-Chi is forced to face his past and his father's organization of the Ten Rings. Now this is an action film, all out Kung fu -y type stuff, and I absolutely love it. I love the film because I knew I, I knew I would going into it, I think, because I knew it had a lot of well choreographed Kung Fu scenes. Um, I love stuff like the Bruce Lee films, the old Bruce Lee films and Jackie Chan, etc. So I love to see all those really well performed um, choreographed fight scenes and these were really well done that first fight on the bus is so good it's just it's really uh, gonna go down as MCU's history as one of the best fights going on, on in MCU I believe because it's just so good and then the, there's the fight on the the construction tower that was really good so yeah the fight scenes were mwah, beautiful also the look of the film was beautiful as well I'm not sure what they did with it. There was a very um, crouching tiger, hidden dragon kind of part to the film. I think it's midway through the film, this whole new world gets revealed and it's just stunning to look at. The CGI isn't like just obviously CGI in your face, looks like a walking computer game. It's actually really good and I really did enjoy it. A feast for my eyeballs. The acting was on point, I think. The main character, Shang-Chi, was very likeable and kind of charismatic. Um, he wasn't like over the top or anything like that. And he was just getting to know his kind of powers and his sort of just becoming his character, I think, as well. So I think um, we're gonna see a lot more of him in the future. And I'm definitely on board for that because I think it was really good. Aquafina. Now, a lot of people I've heard have said that she's very annoying. Um, I didn't find her that annoying. I think her comedy was just to the point where if she'd gone any further with it, it would have got annoying. But she just had that sort of level for me. It was goofy, her sort of comedic style and a little bit cheesy sometimes, but I think it worked within the film. And I think he did need that sort of uh, comedic foil to his straight man because he's a very sort of serious character in this um shang chi and his friend obviously counterbalances that with a little bit of comedy and it's needed and it's the mcu comedy so it's not you know you, you know what you're getting with that kind of comedy it's always it's always pretty much funny you know what i mean um and sometimes they may overdo it but i don't think this was overdone there was a point midway in the film where the action kind of lulled and I was just sort of sitting there thinking, right, when's the next fight? Because I just really enjoyed the fight scene so much. But then we were taken into a whole new world of uh, like beautiful visuals and it kind of took me, uh, took my mind off waiting for the action fights, fight scenes. But when the, the final act came in and the big final fight scene came in, that was so good as well. That was so worth it. and. Um, yeah, it was just a really enjoyable film. The Mandarin himself, the main villain, played by Tony Lung, was was really good. Um, he was a sympathetic villain. You sort of felt for him a little bit as well. Um, like I say, I'm not going to go into plot points, but um, he did 
come across as somebody not to be fucked with also. And the, the rings themselves, or the bracelets in this case more, more so, uh, were actually really cool weapons and the way they used them in different ways, like projecting themselves off the ground and just battering into people's chests and stuff with these rings. It was just actually really uh, imaginative and really well done. So for me, this is the phase four beginning. This is, this is it, this is where it's begun. Um, Black Widow doesn't count for me. It's kind of like um, a film out of time. That, that, that film came out too late. Um, and, and I personally never wanted that film anyway. I know there was uh, years back, people were saying, oh, I really want a Black Widow film. For me, I really didn't care either way. And the Black Widow film was okay. And it wasn't anything new and it didn't progress the MCU forward. Unlike this, which is a breath of fresh air because it's actually something different and something we haven't seen in the MCU before. Obviously, culture, culturally, I can't speak very well, um, the Asian community is um, well represented in this film, obviously, and it's really nice to see. This film was a definite thumbs up from me. Definitely go and watch it at the cinema if you can, if you feel safe to do so, etc. because it's well worth your time. Um, it is now in fairly high ranks as one of my favorite MCU films. I'm gonna go out there and say that. It's not like, it's not my top MCU film, that's for sure. Maybe because I've just seen it. Maybe if I give a little bit of time and let, let it uh, settle down a little bit and my thoughts may change on it. But at the minute, it's a very high up there move, MCU movie because I love that shit. I love that Kung Fu stuff. The comedy was on point. The visuals are amazing. Yeah, loved it. What did you think of Shang-Chi? Have you seen it? Let me know in the comment section down below. And I love you very much. God bless. Goodbye. <laughs>